everybody and welcome back to another video so in this video it is going to be a vlog and I have not done a vlog on this have I ever done a vlog on this channel no but I do have a vlog channel so if you want to see more vlogs and more adventures and mishaps of my life be sure to go and click the link in the description down below to go and check out my vlog channel but in today's video I decided to just take you along with me to go shopping because so many of you you know love my fashion sense and my style and I'm like you know what might as well bring you along and see the process and just <laughs> Oh, also my sister's here with me. Say hello, girl. Hello. <laughs> there are a few things on my list today. I want to go to Target and get a planner because mine expired. Um, I also want to go to the container store and get more storage because I just built an Ikea unit set. How's that going to go in? There's all sorts of f***ing screws in this shit. And I just need more storage things for my makeup because I just have so much now from PR and it's a mess. Then I want to go to the mall because I just, um, I, I need retail therapy basically because life is just so stressful and honestly just spending all your money and going broke is the best way to relieve your stress. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. But yes, without further ado, let's get on to the video. Whoosh. Oh, why hello there. We've made it to our first destination, Tarje. I'm feeling super basic in LA. LAE, is that even a thing? LAE right now. So we're gonna go to Target and get some supplies. Um, what I wanted to get here? A planner and some other knickknacks probably. Who knows? I mean, it's a Target adventure, right? Oh my gosh, hit us please, hit us please, hit us please. Oh man, they didn't hit us. <laughs> Ooh, yes, I wanted to look at the room decor too because I'm in the process of redoing my room. Um, so actually, let's go look. Oh, look at this, this is so fuzzy. Oh my god, yes. I love that. Oh my god, yes. Mm, I kind of want a pink pillow. This is cute, but I'm like that shape. No, we're not about that rectangle life. Okay, we want a square pillow, people. Honestly, my room is a mess right now. I don't even know what aesthetic I want to go for. All I know is I want more color. It's a little black and white right now, and if you've seen my backdrop, it's been there for like three years. I know if you're new, you'd probably be like, oh, like I've only seen it for like, you know, a few days or like a few weeks for however long you just joined, but I want to redo it. It's been there for a while, and I just want to feel re-inspired, y'all, oh, okay? motivated to make better content and like different types of videos. <gasps> what is this? Ooh, she is pink, she is fluffy, but it's very light on camera. I'm not sure if I feel that. Hmm. Oh yes, freaking finally. The stationery, where? <gasps> Planners, right? Yeah, yeah. <gasps> These are so cute, but they're, <laughs> but they're very basic and very um, fashion blogger-esque. Every moment counts, yes. Um, be kind, be brave, be awesome. Oh my god, what if one said flawless? You know what? I would get that girl. Okay, this is too big. This is too small. Like, I want something that's practical, that will make me feel productive, um, get my life together, basically. Okay, so it turns out that none of them are actually planners. They're just notebooks. So that just shows you how much of a flop I am, and I need a planner in my life. Are you trying to tell me I'm gay? Girl. My hair is a mess after the little carpool karaoke video. I'm gonna fix it real quick. Which, by the way, if you're wondering what hairspray I use, I use the Carnier Fructis Flexible Control. Yes, the yellow one. Alright, so Target was a success, and now we're gonna go to the storage store and get some containers for my makeup. Yes. <laughs> oh, yes, honey. We have made it. We have made it. Let's see what we're gonna need. Um, I think I need one of these for sure. Just gonna, just gonna set you right there. One of these long ones, yes. Actually, make it two long ones. We like long ones. All right, so we are now back from Target and the little container store, and I ended up not getting the long ones because they were a little too long. So, um, lesson learned here, kids. Don't get things that are too long. Let me focus real quick. Oh my God. 
But like, do y'all ever park somewhere and then you walk to your store or your destination and you're like, oh, that wasn't too far. But then walking back, you're like, damn, did I really park this far? Because that was just me just now, like mood. I always flip my like non-existent hair. I don't know why. It just makes me feel sassy, like a little queen, okay? Leave me alone. Oh my god, it's green. <laughs> Am I gonna make it? 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 Ooh, I'm gonna make it. Okay, 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 okay. I made it, y'all. I made it. I did that. Things I did, that. But we are now on our way to the mall, okay? Do a little haul, a little shopping. Um, I haven't been shopping in quite some time because I've just been busy. Uh, there I go again, flipping my non-existent hair. I've just been busy filming and editing for y'all and just spending time with my family. Um, and now I'm just going to, you know, take a break from the dark cave that I'm from and, you know, get some vitamin D, live it up, interact with people. My family and I used to go shopping all the time though, like every weekend. I don't know if it's like an Asian thing or like if it's just because, I don't know, like other families, they would go on like a hike, they would go on a picnic, they would go to like, I don't freaking know, an amusement park. But my family and I, we would just go to the mall every weekend because we, did, we, hadn't, we, we didn't know where else to go. So we just went to the mall and I flipped my hair again. You know, it's really hard to film and vlog in the car without your freaking AC on because it will be too loud. Like, listen. Oh. <laughs> like, I don't think that would be very enjoyable and pleasurable for your ears. So that's why I have to sit through the damn heat for y'all, okay? So please like this video, please subscribe because I'm sitting in this heat for y'all. Oh, we about to enter a tub. Oh, what are you doing, sweetie? Uh-uh. You need to get out the way. Thank you. Goodness, the nerve of some people. Back it up. Found a spot, we gonna back up. Back it up, back it up, back it up, back it up. Signal, yes. Uh Oh my god. Don't you hate it when people are like in your way? Like out of all the times in the world, you could have been out of my way, but the universe decided to line our times together and have you in my way, okay? Maybe I'm a little impatient, but you know what? I get it from my mom. And boom, we are in the Batmobile. Batmobile, Batcave, whatever. I think I'm doing a pretty good job of vlogging while driving. You know, I think I'm gonna do this more often. It's really fun. Anyway, <gasps> let's go. Did I lock my car? Beep, beep. See, I never remember if I ever like lock my car, but whatever, okay. Um, oh my god, that's scared. <laughs> Uh, thank you, my assistant, you peasant. No, 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 don't give it to me. I don't, no, 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 you're holding it for me, honey. That's the whole point. <laughs> Going into Nordstrom. Now, if you know me, now, if you know me, I love Nordstrom. Yes, it is a little bit of a basic store, but you know what, it's okay. It's cute, it has a really good return policy, which is another reason why I love it so much. And also, oh my goodness, I think the Nordstrom anniversary sale, oh my lord. The Nordstrom anniversary sale is happening like next week or something, which I should probably, I should have probably waited until next week to come shopping, but you know what, that's okay. We'll get a sneak peek of everything. Um, but yeah, let's go. Ooh, yes, we love a renovating queen. Ooh, yes, oh. <laughs> Oh yes, girl, we've made it to my favorite section, Top Shop. Okay, so we're gonna do a little segment called How to Shop with Kevin, or How Kevin Goes Shopping. So, um, cue the music. So step one on shopping with Kevin is just finding things that you gravitate towards to, that is your style, or things that are not like this, like, no girl. Um, I like things that are like a little bit of a statement that is still wearable, that isn't like too in your face. Um, I also don't really like things that are a little too basic, like this over her. It's a little too basic. We don't want to be basic like that, okay? And also, it depends on your personal style. I really like these girly type of styles, like the little flowy, little frillies. Like, that's my personal take. Um, I really like this for the summertime, but I've already owned like so many shirts like this, so I don't need any more. That's another good thing, making sure that you don't get like the same things that you already have in your closet that could be like mixed and matched. So make sure you know what's in your closet before you go shopping, okay? 
Now, one of the biggest tips when I go shopping is making sure I have a list of things that I know what I want. So like, if I know I want a blue t-shirt, I will go shopping for a blue t-shirt. That way I focus on that and not like anything else because let's be real here, that is how you spend money and go broke, okay? Ooh, now this is kind of cute. This is a look. It's like stars and like off the shoulder. Like she is giving me some attitude and sass like Edna mode is shook. Oh, also another fashion tip. Okay, I've always wanted a black denim skirt, but like don't spend your money on like a Topshop black denim skirt when you can go to Forever 21. Oh, you know my gay ass about to get on this. I hope you enjoyed that little segment of how to shop with Kevin and the tips and tricks. Um, but anyway, let's go ahead and cash out. <laughs> Y'all, I've asked y'all in a previous video before if I should ever pierce my ears, and I'm just so, and I'm just so tempted to because like I don't know, I really like these like fun statement earrings. I don't know, like they just look so fun to me for like the summertime or something. So I'm not sure. Maybe I'll pierce my ears one day, but I don't know. Look how fun these are. Oh. Y'all, I just got a compliment on my outfit, which I did not give you an OOTD yet. Like, how fake am I? That OOTD shirt is from Zara. It is this little crop top, little yellow buttoned up. And then I'm just wearing, oh my god. Actually, you know, girl, you're gonna have to film me. <laughs> crop top from Zara. Jeans are from Nordstrom. And then I'm wearing white Birkenstocks. And then I'm just wearing a backpack from Zara as well. Um, but oh my goodness, let me know if compliments just like make your day because honestly, I feel so empowered now. Like, I just want to slay the world. Like, nobody can mess with me. Like, get out of my way. Y'all, we rolling with the LGBT. Hello, vlog. We have some viewers here. They work at Nordstrom, too. So, like, like my home, my second home, Nordstrom. And then the boys here, like, one way, maybe. Like, it all makes sense. What are your guys' names? I'm Chelsea. I'm Nicole. Oh, yes. Anyway, say hi to vlog. <laughs> Oh my god, they are so nice. I haven't been to the mall in like a month, but the Nordy girls know how to treat me so well. Like, I just love meeting y'all, whether you're Nords from employees or just, you know, little high schoolers or middle schoolers. Just come say hi, y'all. Come say hi. So for graduation, my cousin gave me a Nordstrom gift card and I could not find anything in the clothing section. So let's go to shoes. Maybe I'll find some cute shows. He gave me like a $50 gift card, so shout out to Daniel. Let's see if we can find something crote. Oh, these are cute. These are cute little, little heel sandals, yes. But the thing is, I don't go out or like do anything fun, y'all. Like I literally stay at home, film videos, and edit for y'all. So maybe I need to go out more, or maybe I just need to get shoes that are more practical, or maybe I don't need anything at all. Okay, Nordstrom was a bust. It was a letdown. One of my favorite stores. Could not find anything, but you know what? That's okay. I'm just gonna wait for the anniversary sale because there's probably gonna be better things there. Um, anyway, on our way to <gasps> Forever 21. Y'all, we coming into my favorite store. We are coming in hot to my favorite store. Do y'all see it? Do y'all see it? Y'all, my favorite store. <gasps> Anime World. Oh my god, it's so cute, y'all. But we know damn well this shit is expansive as hell. I actually got my stuffed llama alpaca? Alpaca? Alpaca. 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 I actually got my stuffed alpaca, son Frankie, at not the anime store because they sell him at like the anime store, but it's like 50 bucks. It is so expensive. I actually got him at an anime convention. Y'all, I just made a friend. I just bought this alpaca for 30 bucks and it was on sale for $30. So I got a deal at the anime convention. So don't spend 50 bucks on an alpaca, okay? It's not worth it, y'all. It's not worth it. Also, so many people ask me, Kevin, like, are you not shy vlogging in public? I'm like, not really. Like, I did not work so hard on myself for 22 years to not be confident. You know what I mean? Like, what are they gonna do? Stare at me? They gonna do? Stare at me? They gonna do? Stare at me? Stare at me. I look cute. You know what I mean? Like, my outfit's cute. My face is cute. So stare all you want, honey. <laughs> Oh, yes, yes. Thank you so much, my assistant. <laughs> Ooh, we is in Forever 21, and YouTube, please don't copyright me just in case this music is too poppin', y'all. So let's go ahead and find some inexpensive summery pieces here that I could wear because a majority of my clothes are actually from Forever 21. Actually, surprisingly, none of this is from Forever 21, but... Oh my god, we are twinning, girl. We are sisters. Y'all, oh my goodness, this is so cute, but my manly ass is not going to be fitting a size small, okay? These man shoulders, mm-mm. Wow, they have nothing in my size, y'all. I wanted this rust wrap ruffle dress. I freaking love wrap dresses, but it's all size small. These shoulders. So I bumped into a viewer. Hello, what's your name? Uh, Danny. Danny, oh my goodness, yes. So she says she watches me on YouTube. 
my it's style. So oh, thank you. Yes, I'm going shopping today, so it makes sense. Anyway, thanks for saying hi. Girl, we just had a little mini meet and greet. I had no idea. I did not schedule this. I did not plan this, but that's the good shit I like, y'all. Ooh, what is this, y'all? I saw colors and stripes, and I like gravitate. Oh, wait, like splits? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh my goodness, it goes up so high. Girl, you gonna see my pussy, uh-uh. Y'all, I found more gay shit. Ooh, going upstairs. Y'all, I'm getting mad as hell. I'm ready to fight. Literally, everything I find that is cute is not in my size. I'll be like, oh my god, this is so cute. And then it'll be all size smalls. And I'm like, I'm a medium. And I just, first world problems. Me on grinder. Okay, well, Forever 21 was a fail. Um, I'm getting a little hungry. How are you feeling, girl? Thirsty. Thirsty, hungry. Let's go. Let's get a little pinkity drinkity. I haven't had it in so long. I'm in the mood for that actually because it's like summertime. It's like perfect weather here though, which by the way, I heard there's a heat wave in LA. It was like $120 <laughs> degrees. And I was like, oh hell no. I could barely manage like 80 degrees. Call me a wimp, but you know what? That's just me getting used to the Seattle weather, okay? I, I don't, I cannot do more than 80. Let's be real here. No, not today. No, no, no. What can I get for you? Um, could I get a grande passion tea lemonade? Of course. And a grande pink drink. Anything else for you guys today? That's all. And your name's Kevin, right? Yes. Oh, I have two gift cards. Well, let's try one. You're just a hard person to predict. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Wow, y'all, I'm just making friends left and right if you heard the conversation. Um, but anyway, I'm super excited to get my drink. I'm a little hungry. Don't know what I want to get later. Maybe some Panda Express or Chipotle. I'm not sure though, because we have dinner later with the fam band. So. We got the goods. You know, growing up, going to the mall, I was always looking for cute boys and whatnot, but let's be real here, there's no cute guys here. So don't even bother, literally. Look for cute clothes, not cute guys. You already know where I am, but do I need any more makeup? No, I don't, but am I still gonna be here? Yes, I am. Ooh, Rihanna coming through with that Fenty Beauty. <laughs> Just got out of Sephora and another shopping life hack with Kevin. Um, go buy yourself like some samples, okay? Because you get more for your money and let's be real here, it's gonna take forever to use up a product anyway, but hey girl, hey. Yes. <laughs> Y'all, I have not been in H&M in forever, but there is a sale going on. Yes, girl, let's come through. Let's get it popping. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Y'all, guess what? I made more friends. Say hi. hi. Introduce yourselves. I'm Rifka. I'm Stella. And we have a friend here. His name is Ryan. Say hi, Ryan. Hi. hi. Thanks for saying hi, everyone. Thank you. Oh, of course. Oh, wow. We're so cute. I love it. Thank you so much for saying hi. Oh my goodness. Have a nice day. Thank you. Bye. I just love y'all. Y'all, it has turned out to be a little meet and greet here in H&M. Say hi, everyone. Hi. Ah, introduce yourselves. I'm Tara. Tara. I'm Paige. Paige. Yes. Yay! Thanks for saying hi. Hi. So H&M was a success, but can we talk about how my total turned out to be like $50? I bought three items. They were all on sale. They were like $15 each. So like math, it'd be like basically $50 in tax and everything, but like, Oh my goodness, it like adds up, y'all. Ooh, another life hack. When I was in the fitting room, I forgot to tell y'all, um, wear shirts that like you don't have to pull over your head so you don't mess up your hair and makeup or get makeup on the clothing pieces because I hate when I try and close, but like I find something that's cute and there's makeup all over it. So yeah, this is like a button up, easy, won't ruin your hair. But um, yeah, I gotta go and take a little waz now, so break time. <laughs> Ready to spend 50 bucks on a shirt. Okay, back from the mall, and can we just say that when I entered Urban Outfitters, 
like things just went amuck, okay? So when I went to the bathroom, there was a security guard. He was just, you know, chilling in there, taking his waz, same with me, you know, twinsies. And I was just like, okay, whatever. But like, I just noticed him because he was just wearing his little uniform, you know? And so I walk into Urban Outfitters and do my little swapping and all that good stuff. And I was about to vlog something, but he interrupted and was like, hi, I just wanted to let you know that the cameras in the mall caught you filming and that's not allowed. And I was just like, oh, okay, that's whatever, that's fine. Getting, uh, getting camera around the mall, we cannot do that. Oh, I can't film? I was like, you know, like it makes sense, whatever. They have their rules, yada, yada, yada. So I didn't. But then when I go and leave Urban Outfitters, the sensors went off. It was a beep, 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 boop, bop, bop, all that good stuff. And the thing is, other people walked in at the same time as I was walking out. And the employees there were like, excuse me, you know, doing their normal things, whatever. It, it's understandable. Um, but they literally treated me as if I were a criminal. Oh my God, clickbait. I was arrested. <laughs> um, basically, they ran through each bag, making sure nothing was beeping, making sure nothing was, you know, making the sensors go off. I walked through my sister walked through it was good it was Gucci but then the employee there I don't know I don't know if this was like part of protocol of like if this is normal or whatnot but she literally digs through my bag and like runs each individual item through the sensors of at the front door and I'm like way I don't know I felt that that was a little weird like running each bag was fine but then going through each item and running through it I thought it was a little weird I felt as if that was an invasion of privacy <laughs> Cardi B Oh, I make money moves. I don't know. To me, that was like going through my bag or something. It was weird. But like literally nothing went off. So I don't know why she had to open my bag and like look through my stuff. And I don't know. It was just so weird in Urban Outfitters, y'all. I literally felt like a criminal. Okay. I was on the wanted list. <laughs> not my fault. I'm so cute. Okay. You're not going to handcuff my cute ass today. Okay. But anyway, we're just going to go home now. And then I'll do a quick haul before. <gasps> oh my God. Traffic. Okay, we have made it home and now onto the haul. I'm gonna put this on you, thank you very much. So at Target, I just needed to get a planner and I decided to get this one. It's rose gold, I think it's super cute, super my aesthetic. Um, and a lot of the planners there, it was like laid out as if like, it were a time schedule, it'd be like one o'clock, you would do this, two o'clock, like by every hour. And I did not like that, cause I'm like, bitch, like I don't even know what I'm doing every hour. So I really liked how this one is just open-ended and like, you know, you could do whatever you want. Next, I went to the storage store and I just got a bunch of acrylic stuff because <coughs> <coughs> I needed more storage for my makeup, so I got that. And lastly, at the mall at Sephora, I just got a $30 gift card from when I did someone's prom makeup, so shout out to you, girl, if you're watching this. Um, so for the $30 gift card, I got this cleanser and moisturizer set. This was like in the traveling section, which by the way, like I said, if you wanna get more for your money, go to the, you know, small travel size stuff because you can get more for your money. Um, anyway, this was 25 bucks and then I just got a bunch of samples and then I got this Clinique Take the Day Off Balm and I have a smaller size of this um, and so this is like a little mini medium size, 10 bucks, uh, 35 bucks. I had to pay a little bit extra, but anyway, that's all I bought. And then at H&M where I did some damage, which by the way, I did not actually spend any of my own money because I still had like gift cards from graduation and everything. So shout out to my relatives. But y'all, I was shook when she said $50 cause I was like, what? But y'all, I was shook when she said $50 because each of these pieces were like 15 bucks each, but then again, it adds up. So the first item was just this little red striped ruffly little blouse top thingamajig. Um, I don't know. It just looked super fashion bloggery and that's just like one of my styles, okay? My sister tells me I look like a mom. I look like a white suburban mom, basic AF, but you know what? That's okay. I, I, I want to look like a MILF, okay? Some more cute girly bohemian stuff. This is just an off the shoulder shirt and I actually wore it like this and it was like comfortable and fine and looked cute too so I could wear it both ways if I'm feeling you know a little bit scandalous or I want to you know be more conservative and lastly I just got some sweat shorts because I had a pair like this a few years ago and I actually ripped it yesterday there's a hole do y'all see this mm -mm, I've been honing around too much um so I decided to get a new pair because I wear them all the time especially working at home so I just 
toss them on, throw on a cute shirt. Little do you know, I'm wearing sweats when I'm filming a video. That is my haul. That is my shopping vlog. That is my vlog. Let me know in the comments down below if you enjoy vlogs like this and if I should do more because, I don't know, changing it up, you know, spicing it up for y'all. <laughs> but yes, I love you all so, 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 so much. And remember, everyone, to be flawless is to be yourself. Bye!